welcome back to my channel. My name is Katie and welcome to Katie Paper Designs. Today, I have a very, very exciting news to share with you and that's Canva Desktop App is already available for download and installation on your computers. Are you ready? Let's go ahead and get started. <music> So as you can see right now, um, I have here um, a website that says Canva for Mac. The website that I entered, which is canva.com forward slash download. So I'm going to show that to you right now. Actually recognize that I'm using a Mac computer. So if you are using a PC or a Windows machine for that matter, then you will be using or you will be seeing Canva for Windows. All right, so I'm going to show you the installation process. I actually was very excited to try it out already earlier, um, but I decided that I'm going to show you the entire process so that you will be able to follow along. All right, so um, let's go. It's April 29, and it's a very exciting day. <laughs> All right, April 29, 2020, that is. It's, it's, it's something that you need to mark on your calendars because today the Canva desktop app finally is available for everyone. All right, so let me go ahead and click start download. And it says, thank you for downloading Canva. It's going to download the file already to my computer. So here, there are some things that you can actually read, like some tips. So in, in order for you to open the file, if your downloads folder, double click on the Canva. It's a DMG file. So it's a DMG file for um, Mac. I think for Windows, if I'm not mistaken, it should be the executable file. So just go ahead and check that out. And then you can drag and drop. Um, the Canva app icon to my applications in the Finder sidebar. So again, this is only for the Mac computers. So it would be a different, a little different process or there would be different terms if you are using Windows, but it would be easy to follow along. It's just like installing any other software that you have had in the past. All right, so um, let's go ahead and wait. It's almost done downloading. So I'm really excited about this because, of course, I like um, apps that are installed in the computer because then again, I can always um, work on it um, outside the browsers. So <laughs> sometimes the browsers make editing a little slower. So I like that it's now an app version. So if you are excited as me <laughs> just follow along all right so let me go ahead and open um let me transfer this to my downloads folder first okay there you go and i'm gonna open it in the downloads folder right now all right so there it's already installing so we just have to be a little extra patient and then i'm going to drag that in the applications folder all right, so let's go and search for that right now. Where is it? Uh, it's hiding from us. <laughs> let's make the window a little bit bigger. And there you go. There's Canva. So I'm going to double click on it and then it's going to open. So it will say Canva is an app download from the internet. Are you sure you want to open it? So I'm going to click on open. And there you go, voila. It's now the Canva desktop app. So it's not via the browser anymore. It's now independent and I can use it. So I'm going to um, log in using my Canva account. All right. So are you excited as this? So let me know what you are. Uh, if you have already downloaded it or if you have tried it already, just leave a comment in the comments box below. If you have questions about Canva, please let me know as well. I am a Canva certified creative. So most probably I have an answer to your Canva questions. But if not, of course, I'm going to go ahead and um, check with my peers so that we can provide you the answer to your question. So there you go. I have already downloaded and installed the Canva desktop app for my Mac computer. Now, um, if you're using Windows again, there might be a slightly different process of installing or if you have a slower internet connection, the download might be slower. So just be a little bit extra patient. It's going to be worth it. Now, let me go ahead and play around with this. If I discover things that I wanted to share with you, then I will be creating a new video. So that's it for me right now. Again, if you have any questions, please do let me know and don't hesitate to ask. All right, so have a great day or night wherever you are. Bye now.